How to play this game. Hey there. If you haven't already, I suggest you first watch our video on how to set up for Fun Family Chess. But if you're already set up and you want to learn how to play, then this is the right video for you. Let's get started. When you start a new game, choose who will play on the light side We're the protectors of love and, light. and the dark side. <laughs> Just remember, in chess, the light side always goes first. There are three simple steps to take each time it's your turn. It's as simple as roll, match, and move. Let me show you what I mean. First, roll the chess cube. Second, match the colored symbol on the chess cube with the same color symbol on the reference card. Like this. Finally, move that piece based on the card's instructions. In this example, I rolled the green pawn symbol. So now I get to move any one of my pawns. And the reference card is there to help me remember how each piece moves. I'll go ahead and move this pawn forward one space. And that's it. My first turn is finished. Pretty simple, huh? Here are two things to keep in mind. First, you must move. However, if it's not possible to move the piece you rolled, then you get to roll again. In other words, if you no longer have that piece, or if its movement is blocked by other pieces, then you roll again until you can move. Second, if you roll a star, that means you get to choose any one of your pieces to move. So the star gives you a lot of power. Fun, right? You might notice that there's no king symbol on the chess cube. So the only way to move your king is if you choose to do so when you roll a star. And if you have more than one of the piece type you rolled, just choose one of them to move. Let's talk about capturing pieces. You can capture your opponent's piece if you land on its square. You then get to take their piece off the board and put it to the side. The last thing to go over is how do you win this thing? In Fun Family Chess, you win by capturing your opponent's king. If you can put your opponent's king in jail, you win. And remember, don't forget to protect your king while going after theirs. And that's all you need to know to play Fun Family Chess. If you think you've got it, then feel free to start playing now. Or if you want to see a few sample plays to help everything sink in, then keep watching because there's more fun ahead. Okay, let's pretend we're starting a new game together. You're on the light side and I'm on the dark side. You go first and roll the chess cube. You rolled a rook. The reference card shows how the rook moves, and we see your rooks can't move this turn because they're blocked by your other pieces. No problem, just roll again. You rolled a pawn. Since pawns can travel one or two spaces on their first move, you decide to move this pawn forward two spaces. Great job, your first turn is finished. If you ever feel confused about how to move, be sure to watch our video on how each piece moves. It will definitely help as you're getting started. Let's fast forward to later in the game so you can see a couple captures, and of course, see who wins. It's now your turn and you roll a star. Nice. You look at the pieces you have left and decide to capture my knight with your queen. Good for you. I'm feeling a little nervous, but it's my turn now. And I roll a rook. Yes. That's just what I wanted because I'm capturing your queen. It's your turn now. You pick up the cube and roll. It's a knight, but you don't have any knights left, so you roll again. Oh no, a bishop. You move your bishop across the board and capture my king. Great job, you won. This time. <laughs> now you know how to play a fun family chess, so get that game out and have some fun. Oh, and don't forget to watch our other chess videos at mybrainblocks.com. <laughs>
Chung 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 